It's crazy though if you like look at it. So, like, the, well, because people were like still talking about, even though on that election a couple of weeks ago, whenever it was, it was the lowest in the UK for years and years and years. I think that's because like everybody's. I, I don't think they're waking up. I just think they were sick. But still, this is, shows the ob obscenity of it and 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 how uh, ridiculous it is. Less people voted for that idiot, that Pierre Starmer, than that had voted for the other parties. Right, but because the way that they set it up, which is completely fake, fake anyway, he still gets to be prime minister. So then they give us this country here, right? That you've got what they call a king, whose best friend was Jimmy Savile, right? Who who, who that like there was around. He spent just as much time in Buckingham Palace as as Charlie Boy, I think. So. Then now also, it, the Keir Starmer, who's supposedly a prime minister helping to run the country or running the country on behalf of the king, uh, was the guy who was actually in the Crown Prosecution Service, the head guy of the Crown Prosecution Service, when they were investigating Savile and said, no, 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 nothing to worry about. Nothing to say here, sir. Let's move along, you know, and let's wait until he's dead and then we're going to start talking about him. 